Fusion Blend. You will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple. Dumb down the host population that the parasitic technocracy is feeding on. We may not have been able to get fluoride out of the water supply yet, but we can help to get it out of our bodies. I am extremely excited to announce the exclusive InfoWars Life Fluoride Shield Formula fusing six of the best documented ingredients from around the world to help the body remove not just toxic fluoride residues from the body, but a whole host of toxic substances. Let's take a stand against the globalist by blocking their poisons with Fluoride Shield. I use Fluoride Shield every day. Secure your Fluoride Shield and other pioneering formulations at InfoWarsLife.com today. Let's start cleansing our bodies now and support the InfoWar at the same time. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Why does the United States spend the largest percentage of GDP in the world on health care? Why do we have the highest cancer rates on the planet? The highest rates of diabetes, autism, and every other major disease. It all comes down to one thing. We are what we eat. Our food is devoid of nutrition and processed with poisons and additives. Our water is filled with toxic poisons and big pharma runoff. All of this has been engineered by design. We can turn the tide against the eugenicist by giving ourselves the nutrients our body desperately needs. To learn more, visit InfoWarsHealth.com. The site is literally packed with audio and video featuring top health professionals who don't bow down to big pharma. The fight against the new world order starts with you, and you can't stand against the machine if you're sick, tired, and obese. When you visit InfoWarsHealth.com, be sure and check out the catalog with nearly 400 life-changing products and get free shipping when you sign up for AutoShip. Introducing Pro One. All of your filtration in one system, portable, on the go. No more do you have two or three filters to just reduce sodium fluoride. You have a system that cuts out the sodium fluoride and up to 95% of hydrofluorosilicic acid. Advanced manufacturing technology combines silver impregnated white ceramic with new Aquamedics advanced media for removal of fluoride and other heavy metals, all in one filter element. It is the only one that does it and out of the gate. We have it discounted at 10% off with promo code WATER. This is the only system that in one unit helps reduce or remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, ammonia, and chlorine, hydrofluorosilicic acid, the most common form of fluoride not covered by other fluoride filter brands, and sodium hexafluorosilicate. Get your Pro Pure with the new Pro One filters today at InfoWarsStore.com or by calling 888-253-3139. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Live from Austin, Texas, broadcasting worldwide, it's Alex Jones. You wonder why we're in so much trouble. Former top neocon in the Bush administration, David Frum, has come out, we have the article up on InfoWars.com and said that if you want to own guns, you shouldn't be able to own guns. If the people that want guns are the people that probably shouldn't have guns. That's not actually true statistically, but what does it even matter? This is the whole collectivist model. You have a political ruling class that literally wants to be in charge with a, with a monopoly of power. And I'll explain to you why this is such a big deal. Why Reuters last Thursday came out and, and said, oh, look at the EU model. We should do that here where they bail in and take 40% out of your bank account and give it to private banks. We're going to have to have that here where the government safeguards our 401ks and our IRAs by consolidating them and running them and taking a large piece of them, nationalizing them. That's where all this is going. That's why they're putting the police state in place. That's why they're militarizing the police. That's why they're overthrowing our basic constitution and bill of rights. The Declaration of Independence said he has kept among us, that's the King of England, in times of peace, standing armies without the consent of the legislature. The legislatures. And, and, and that's it. I mean, you know third world countries have troops on the street. And I can't go to any big event now, I don't care if it's a kite festival or what it is, without military being there searching bags and stuff, as if a terrorist wouldn't just walk up to the checkpoint and blow it up there. And again, I'm not even against the military person out there doing it. 
they're being conditioned, the public's being conditioned, I'm being conditioned, you're being conditioned to accept this. And it's targeted in all the manuals at folks that basically like Hank Williams Jr., John Wayne. I mean, literally, I've been to the Urban Warfare Drills. I've made four films on it. Road to Tyranny, Police State 2000, they're free online. Go look them up. Where I went to the drills, first of anybody. We're talking, in some cases, 18 years ago. Where they were training, no, I'm an American, I have rights, not the camp. And practicing executing uh, patriots. I mean, I have it on video, and then, and then the Marine Corps colonel runs over and goes, Jones, you're not supposed to be part of this, filming that. Because they let me in to film it, knew who I was. This was out in California in one drill, Urban Warrior, 1999. And they were telling the media, it's for overseas. Well, obviously it has a dual use, but they're on tape. I have it on tape going, where'd you get the guns and equipment in San Francisco? And so your allegiance is to, uh, then the, you know, the officers run over and say, get him out of here. <laughs> and they didn't stop us because I already had backup people outside who then said they were just tourists and they had to give them authorization to let them get the tourist trip. And then they got all the footage. But th they're hiding this because it's totally illegal. And now you have the NDAA, all the rest of it. It's very, very serious. David Knight, we have some other n n fake newscasts they produced last year for Homeland Security that they show police uh, to, to, again, simulate that gun owners are the ones that are going to kill everybody, that gun owners are the ones that are going to launch bio attacks. They had last week, as uh, mainstream news reported, that we mentioned drills where gun owners are going to release bio weapons. Mm hmm they are 20, the sitcoms, the dramas, the movies. The issue is this used to happen secretly on a very small scale. Now it looks like a full rollout. And what is your take on all this? Well, we keep see, seeing it happen over and over again in these scenarios that come out. Over and over again, it's the same. In almost every case, they're trying to fight Americans. Absolutely. And if you look back at the NDAA, the thing that concerns everybody, when we see this infrastructure tyranny being created, the fact that they would do indefinite detention without trial, be done by the military, and it's put into the defense spending bill, the authorization for that. Now, they also are hearkening to the fact that, well, we have an authorization for the use of military force. So therefore, you know, they see the entire world under this post 9-11 scenario, the entire world. And again, our military is run by these globalist interests. That's right. Now, in this video, one of the things that was up there visually that I didn't talk about is I, freeze, I froze a frame there where you could see the handicapped parking signs. You mentioned it as you're watching it there. See, handicapped parking signs in English, you see the speed limit signs. Everything about that is a very detailed American city. And, and they admit they're training for that in their own documents, but then lie to the media. Yes. Because we're the enemy. Yes. It's a PSYOP. Yes, and, and of course, they're also going after these mainline Christian groups like the American Family Association, the Family Research Council. Last year, Fox News, after we broke it, covered it, and the Army Secretary confirmed, you know, we teach that if you're in an evangelical period, you will be court-martialed, and you can give no money to the Tea Party. And you see over and over again, these guys with the high-ranking officials, lieutenant colonels, colonels, talking about how these are the enemy. They're going right down the talking points of the Southern Poverty Law. Oh, we have their local, uh, the, uh, the, the, the PR piece, Put out by the Army from the Asymmetrical Warfare Center. It's up on Infowars.com in the, in the article. And then, and then radio listeners can actually see the video and the documents and the, and the FM field manuals and all the numbers and links if you're doubting us. This is so amazing. And you can see right there um, that, that they're training for domestic operations and, and that it's just absolute treason. And then, again, the big question is, why are they training to do this? And why in their own video do they say, well, we're preparing for the next war, the next threat, and it's America. It's us when everything collapses. Well, we just had a retired colonel that used to teach history at West Point write an article in Esquire saying, yes, we will take the guns out of your cold, dead That hands. was the headline. Hopefully, you will be dead of natural causes by then. But he said, hopefully. In other words, if necessary, we'll take them and we'll, we'll kill you to take the guns out of your hands. Hopefully, you'll die of natural causes. And see, he's teaching history at the military academy. And that's where he sees the future. You know, when they go into the school. Yeah, hey, it came out that same week when that propaganda. broke up, a month yeah. ago when that broke, that multiple professors at Texas A&M were teaching that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this is a total takeover and they're doing it. That's right. That's I'm right. now hearing police on the news going, owning firearms is a privilege. Yes.
Yes, and, and interestingly enough, we see people who are pushing back against this in the courts having victories, just like we had the victory on Thursday in the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. And we've had victories in both Washington and in Chicago. But of course, even when the Supreme Court tells these liberals, because they maintain that the Constitution is a living document, and if the Supreme Court says- They don't follow sex, it. They still don't follow it. Because they're not liberals. Exactly. They're authoritarians. Well, what would you call these people? I would call them authoritarians. That, that's a, their status. They want to take over everything, have the government run everything. And they're basically a, a group of criminals who are running the government. They are not going to be held to any law. And they've got the Republican leadership on their side. Absolutely. Let's, let's play this fake newscast produced last year by Homeland Security. This is in the same article, demonizing uh, gun owners. Uh, this is the stuff they show police because there's no real examples of this. So they manufacture it. They have school drills. We've got video of that coming up where the gun owners come to kill the children because they're, quote, tea partiers, and they tell the kids in the drill, right. the tea partiers are coming to kill you, which is nothing but mind control. This is brainwashing. This is like Jim Jones saying, you know, drink the Kool-Aid when the feds come, or, you know, you, know, you, you won't they, go to heaven. They want people to be deathly afraid whenever they see a gun. That's why they'll sometimes allow concealed carry but not open carry, and they want you to be deathly afraid of certain things like anybody labeled as a tea partier that's somebody that's danger or militia that's because that's like such a popular movement now yeah and is literally taking over the republican party uh, let's go to that uh, fake newscast here it is we interrupt our regular programming for this special report reports of possible illegal activity by a local militia group appears to have spurred law enforcement into action john gleason has our story this is the scene of an intensive investigation into the operations of an extremist group reportedly planning a series of terrorist attacks on u.s cities details are sketchy but allegedly the militia was using this house to store a cache of military weapons a hazmat unit is now inside the house searching for evidence while uh, behind me are other local fire and hazmat teams. The FBI is here, as well as other agencies. Earlier today, police raided the house and arrested two men on charges of illegal possession of firearms. But they apparently found more than they were bargaining for. So it's all about creating this hysteria. And the simulation that gun owners are about to do all this because, folks, clearly this is all being done to then stage events, blame it on us, and then have political persecution. That's why I harp on this. We're going to come back and cover a bunch of other news on the Second Amendment. Uh, Time Magazine admits fluoride's brain damaging children. I can't believe that. But, I mean, David, this is just, this is just crazy. Because us saying, have due process, don't have troops on the street, that's just saying be somewhat of a free country. Yeah. This is 101 free country stuff. Well, they clearly are training for this kind of scenario. I think that was what was going to happen in Boston. And now we see these attacks on these power plants. And they're saying this one uh, group shot up the Transformers. And they release right after that saying that looks like we had another shooting at a nuclear reactor facility. We're going to come back and talk about that. Because remember, in Boston, half the city had to come out with their hands up. It'd be like right. a blonde woman. They put a gun to her head and knock her around. Setting the precedent that they could have martial law citywide for one guy who, by the way, got out of their gauntlet and was outside the city. And he's pled not guilty and was a patsy. I'm Alex Jones, InfoWars.com. Alex Jones here with a message to fellow freedom lovers. The prognosis for the entire planetary economic system runs from bad to worse. The globalist model is to shut down societies and starve patriots out until they acquiesce to the global takeover. That's why we've assembled the most vital and important preparedness items at InfoWarsShop.com. These are items that I did research on, that I personally use. You've got the life straw, so you can turn fetid water into safe water anywhere you go. The KTOR hand crank generator to charge up key equipment during power outages or out in the field. Strategic relocation, third edition by Joel Skousen. When disaster strikes by Matthew Stein. Therosafe used by Homeland Security to protect yourself during any radiological event. Hand crank shortwave AM FM radios. Everything that we've researched and found to be the best is available at InfoWarsShop.com and your purchase makes our InfoWar possible. We're getting prepared. Are you? InfoWarsShop.com. In the last 50 years, iodine has been phased out of our staple foods and replaced with the halogen bromine, a practice now banned in nations around the world. Guess what else is in the halogen family? 
fluoride. Ladies and gentlemen, Alex Jones here. In 1924, the federal government did the right thing and encouraged salt producers to add iodine. It's the good halogen on the periodic table. And the results are on record, reports documented, a 15-point IQ increase in areas that had previously been deficient in iodine. Bottom line, iodine is important. Unbound, clean, in a glycerin base, nascent iodine was the answer for myself and my family. You will find Survival Shield nascent iodine exclusively at InfoWarsLife.com. InfoWars Life Survival Shield nascent iodine.